Multiversus isn't a dead game right now, but if the horrible current trends continues, then it probably won't exist in a few months. Ah, good old multiverses, also known as the Warner Brosification of Super Smash Brothers. All things considered, this had a bright future. The library of characters from Cartoon Arc and other WB properties is endless. It's a unique take on the platform fighter genre that does something different. Being free to play also means that everyone has access to it. <laughs> When the game released, the hype was real. And now, all I hear are crickets. A recent article was published by Video Games Chronicle, in which they track some data behind the game. With millions of players competing in multiverses over the initial month it released, things were looking good. Unfortunately, things only rolled downhill. For the first time ever, the game dropped below the 1,000 daily peak player count on Steam. This means that over the course of a day, there were less people playing the game than ever before. According to Video Games Chronicle, this marks a drop in daily peak player count by 99.3574%. No matter how bad your day is going right now, just be happy you're not multiverses. So, what happens here? Why did everyone suddenly stop caring about the Warner Bros. platform fighter? Well, it's not just one reason, it's a whole bunch of smaller things. Developer player first games haven't been adding a ton of worthwhile content or characters to the game. They also delayed season 3 by more than a month, which isn't helping their case. There's also the fact that Multiversus isn't anywhere near as polished as you'd hope. Yeah, it's fun, but it's nowhere near the quality of Super Smash Bros. And of course, that's the elephant in the room. Anytime a new platform fighter comes out, it usually takes direct inspiration from Smash, or at least tries to replicate its success. The only problem is that Smash is nearly impossible to compete with. Seriously. It's as close to perfect as we can get for the genre, which explains why it's been around for decades and shows no signs of slowing down. If there's an indie platform fighter doing well right now, chances are the devs are adding new content and keeping things fresh, giving reasons for players to keep coming back. With Multiversus, you just don't have any of that. People are losing interest. The game was fun while it lasted. I guess. But anyway, that's all for this video. Subscribe for more awesome cartoon videos, give a thumbs up, and comment below to let me know what you think. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.